My name is Calvin Morgelli. I'm the President and CEO of Grand X Incorporated. Um, we're here at Farm Progress 2017 talking about Grain X Command, which is our award-winning uh, product from the Innovations Program. Grain X supplies simplified wireless solutions for, for monitoring and controlling your grain. Okay, our innovation is about simplification at, after harvest time. So most, most of our customers, you know, they put the grain in the bin after storage. Um, a lot of times they are, you know, they're stressed out over harvest, they want a break from harvest and they, we want to give them the freedom to be able to, to, you know, not have to worry about that. So the existing platforms that I've seen out there are quite complicated and it makes it difficult for the farmer to actually achieve their goals. So what we're trying to do is give them a platform that will to that will help them through that process and simplify the, you know, the on-farm storage by maximize the profit by running their aeration, changing the grain content uh, automatically. Okay, with using a, a artificial intelligence unit. So here we have our artificial intelligence unit that controls the aeration fans and the other devices that we use to condition the grain. Okay, so there'll be one of these per site. It uses a, a 110 power supply. It basically, it gathers the data from all the different bins on the site and runs algorithms inside to control the aeration based on the ambient air conditions. So there'll be a weather station attached to this, there'll be a rain sensor, etc. Okay, and then it gathers all that data and processes it based on what we're trying to do in the bin. So we may be putting in an algorithm for rehydrating grain. So we're adding more moist air to, into the grain and bring 6% canola up, or we may be drying the grain after we've harvested the field. Okay? Um, a lot of times the guys are running their fans for extended periods of time, 24 hours a day or only at, in the day, only at night. Uh, generally that can be the wrong time. We're burning extra electricity and we're also either drying out that grain or adding moisture in when we don't want to be. So the whole idea is to have this unit maximize the profit, minimize the shrink and optimize the opportunity in the bin. Okay? We, uh, the user interface itself is going to be app driven, so the, it'll prompt the customer through a series of questions. So we ask the customer what the temperature they want, require in the grain is going to be, the moisture content target, and the time of year that we're going to be marketing the grain. Okay? So that will dictate how aggressive we go with the different algorithms. The, the artificial intelligence unit will then look at the current weather data, also look at future weather data and time of year, and run those that aeration and receive feedback from the system. As it receives the feedback, it modifies the settings to maximize the opportunity uh, for the weather. Each bin is going to get a device on the top. It's a solar powered device. It's magnetic and wireless. So we can actually, very strong magnet, put that on our device. It'll have a battery backup and it'll charge during the day and run on batteries overnight. The device wakes up once an hour and sends the data to the AI unit. Right? From this device, right? We send the output down to our fan control devices, okay, which will start and stop automatically and based on the grain conditions. As we receive the feedback that the grain conditions are changing to where we want them to be, the I unit will also change the set points again to continue to maximize the profit, maximize the grain quality in the bin. So the main main benefit of the Grain X command is to simplify the life for the farmer after harvest, and the most stressful time of the year that we feel. We want to give them the freedom to not have to worry about their grain as much, to maximize their quality of the grain in the bin, and to minimize the shrink, which on a 10,000 bushel of canola bin, generally guys will over shrink at least 1%, and that's about $1,000 on a 10,000 bushel bin. For more information, you can certainly contact us at grainx.com or email at sales at grainx.com. Thank you.
This video is brought to you by Farms.com.